to tell everything that happened to us. They'll lock us up in a padded cell. Then we wouldn't have no more mind than a jaybird. So remember, what happened to us down there just didn't happen. Now listen, haven't you two been in enough trouble lately? Yeah. It's dangerous to leave him in this weakened condition. And about the brain. I don't want to repeat Frankenstein's mistake and revive a vicious, unmanageable brute. This time the monster must have no will of his own, no fiendish intellect to oppose his master. There, my dear Count, I believe I have exceeded your fondest wish. The new brain I've chosen for the monster is so simple, so pliable. He will obey you like a trained dog. Good. How soon? The day after tomorrow. Wilbur was taking you to a masquerade ball. Joan, Chick and I are going to go into the lockers and change our costumes. Come on, Professor. We'll meet you on the dance floor. Okay. And you'll take Wilbur back to the castle. Understand? Yes. I didn't expect to see you here, Doctor. Sandra insisted I come. Besides, I need a little relaxation. Mr. Raymond, would you honor me with the dance? No. No. I warn you, he is Count Dracula. How interesting. Tell me more. Now let me tell you why we dance. Pardon me, Mr. Talbot. Let's have a walk, Wilbur. Hello. I'm going to get me a drink. Mm. Sit here. Look into my eyes. I'm afraid to. There's nothing to be afraid of. Look. Deeper. 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 I look deep enough. I don't want to look anymore. Of course you do. Don't you know what's going to happen now? I'll bite. Oh, no. I will. Wilbur! Joan! Wilbur! Joan! There he is. Wilbur, have you seen Joan? No, but I have definitely made up my mind. You can have Sandra, but make sure you've got plenty of bandages. Maybe Dracula will lure Joan into the woods. No! Joan! Oh, shit, we can't find it. Now, let's keep on looking. Come on. Joan! Tell me you got fast too.
my plans to you. Get me off here. What are you looking out the window for? Somebody else coming after me? Nobody to fight us anymore. Oh, that's too bad. I was hoping to get in on the excitement. Who said that? Allow me to introduce myself. I'm the Invisible Man. <laughs> <laughs> Come in, come in. 
Henry, is it true you've been experimenting with weird drugs that change humans into animals? In a hidden laboratory? Now, if you'll be kind enough to step into the library, I'll be glad to answer any question. 